Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to talk about organizing measures. As you can see, I just started creating this uh, sales report and um, I've already created a few measures. Some of the measures exist in the sales table and some in the top N uh, table. I've got about six to eight measures uh, and I need to build a few more and it's already getting out of hand. I have uh, it all over the place. So I need to organize these measures so it's easy to get to. Uh, so this is how I go about doing it. I first create a blank query and let me call this uh, query as metrics. Now uh, measures is a keyword so I cannot call this table as a measure uh, so I'm going to call it metrics. So once, that, once I have that metrics table, it automatically creates uh, a blank uh, uh, column here, well, which we'll get rid of in a little bit. So now I can go to each of my measures that I've already built, and then I can go into the home table and change this and move this to metrics, right? So simple enough. So I just uh, moved percentage growth, now it's in metrics, um, and uh, similarly, I can move the remaining ones, right? Go to home, it's in measure tools, home table, and then I can pick and uh, pick the table I want to move it, move the measure to. So there you go, that should move prior sales. Similarly, I'm going to go about and uh, move the remaining uh, measures into this metrics table. Okay, so now I have moved all the all my measures into the metrics table. Now this uh, default metrics uh, field that is created, I can hide it uh, so it doesn't show up in uh, in my view. Uh, I cannot delete it, but it's because it's a link to that uh, metrics table, so if you delete it, it's going to throw an error. Just hide it. Okay, so now I have all my measures in the metrics table. Now right now I have about six to eight measures it's fine but as it grows um, let's say i have 50 of these then it gets uh, again out of hand so we can add these into folders as well to keep it much more organized to do that we need to go to this model section and here i can expand out metrics click on each of these uh, measures and uh, i can put this into folders so just type in the name of the folder and uh, it, it goes into this particular folder that you want it to. So I'm putting all my sales related measures into a sales folder and let's say I have a top end one. I'm going to put it into a top end folder. Uh, those ones related to uh, doesn't like the letter in there. Uh, the ones related to VA into VA folder uh, and so forth. All right, let me move all of them. There you go, now that I have all of them moved, they seem, if I go back to my report view, you see all of them are much more organized. I can go to the folder that I uh, want to, um, you know, uh, let's say I'm working with VIA, I can go to that particular folder, pick the metrics I want or measure I want and it, things are much more organized. Uh, so that's how I like to organize my measures, hopefully. Uh, this is some good information for you guys. Uh, if you've got any comments, leave them below. If not, thanks for watching and have a nice day.